Recep Tayyip Erdogan will continue to be Turkish president for five years. The West has not been able to bring down Erdogan, whom they dislike a lot, at a time when the Turkish economy is struggling. I think this reflects the slow decline of West's overall influence and the abrupt and severe loosening of its grip on Turkey, a crossroad of civilizations. Turkey's economy is worsening with very high inflation, but it is no longer getting economic support from the West, and the real benefits of tying itself to the West are getting increasingly smaller. Turkey has been applying for EU membership since 1987, but has not joined so far for political reasons. The country has become a domesticated former barbarian who has helped the West to guard the border, but has not been rewarded for its effort. No wonder they start to have second thoughts. Erdogan won the election, but not by a landslide, and his votes were not much higher than his opponents. This reflects the confusion and hesitation of Turkish society. If the country's economy continues to deteriorate, will the majority of public opinion tend to follow the West again? Not necessarily, because judging from much of the world's experience, chaos is the soil that produces nationalism and a political strongman.